Halloween is here. Now it's time to start thinking about what you want to do with your jack-o'-lantern and fun ways that you can help your kids see that there are always opportunities to be a little more eco-friendly. Today we're going to talk about ways to make that pumpkin be super fun and wind up helping the world a little bit in the end. Welcome to Earth 911 TV. get the most from your Halloween pumpkin while showing your kids that holidays can be earth friendly. The secret is in creative use, reuse, and repurposing. Roasting seeds is an old trick, but a yummy treat. When you're carving your pumpkin, make a point of setting aside the seeds. Pumpkins are full of them. Place the seeds in a colander and rinse them under water to clean them off a bit. Put them on a baking sheet and sprinkle them with a little seasoning like salt or cinnamon and bake at 375 degrees for about 12 minutes or so. Now enjoy having your pumpkin and eating it too. Do you use strings of LED lights for added holiday cheer? Those are great in a pumpkin. Give your creation the added kick of many different colored points of light inside of it rather than just the traditional one. How about a solar powered pumpkin? If you have solar yard lights, consider putting one inside of your pumpkin. Just remember to take it out and charge it outdoors each day so you'll have plenty of light at night. And if you do want to go traditional with the flickering flame of a candle, try one made from soy wax or beeswax rather than paraffin. And look for candles with an all cotton wick for a cleaner burning flame. So Halloween has passed and you're noticing your jack-o'-lantern smile is starting to sag. Time to put your pumpkin to work, enriching the soil for anything you might want to grow next year. Before you start composting, there are a couple of things to keep in mind. You'll want to remove any non-biodegradable items like melted wax, candles, or any decorations you might have attached. If you painted the pumpkin, shave those areas off. And make sure all the seeds are out of it, or you might have pumpkins starting to grow out of your compost pile. If you can smash the pumpkin up a little, that'll help accelerate the composting process, and kids can have a lot of fun with this part. If you don't have a compost pile, just bury small parts of the pumpkin in places where you plan to plant next year and let the soil enrich over the winter. Even if you don't have a yard or a garden, you can still compost. Many cities and towns have drop-off points for pumpkins, so check locally to see what your options are. What are your plans for eco pumpkins this year? Make sure to send us a picture with a comment at earth911.com or on our Facebook page. We'd love to see what you've got going on. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.